Hi everyone, welcome to Hunter Gatherer Cooking. Today we're going to see exactly how New Manor Farm Shop prep their chickens. I had a call from Matty there who's invited me down and we're going to cut straight to it and he's going to show us exactly what they do. I'm going to show you how we get your cuts from a chicken. If you want to barbecue a chicken, do it one way. And my personal favourite, come Christmas or even you could barbecue it or do it as a Sunday roast. Uh, do one with another chicken. So we'll start with these chickens. These are our free range chickens from the Cotswold. It's a Cotswold white chicken. Absolutely fantastic. These guys ring me on a Monday, they kill on a Tuesday, and they come into me every single Wednesday. It's a fantastic, uh, fantastic bird, full of meat, full of flavour, no, no rubbish. Uh, the quality does speak for itself. So what we're going to do, we'll show you what we do with our chickens when they come in. So what we'll do, we'll pull our legs back, cut through the back, snap off your legs. And then what we do is we cut under the hip bone, so that now becomes an oyster leg. And then take that. This will go by if someone wants to have any chickens lots. So you've got your two chicken legs. If you cut them through a little joint just there, that's your drumstick and your oyster thigh. So there's chicken leg, oyster thigh, drumstick. What we do, we'll turn this into a supreme on one side. So you take your wing tip off short, perfect for the barbecue. Come down the top of the chicken, either side, following through the breastbone. There's a, a wing, I forgot what it's called now, a tiny part of the bone there. You follow that down, take that one off, I'll show you what we'll do with that one in a minute. Come down that bone nice and tight. Don't want to waste any chicken flesh because obviously that's the best bit. Little tiny carcass again. That's our chicken supreme. Chicken supreme, tiny little wing bone. I prefer that. Loads of skin, full of flavour. That's your chicken supreme. On the other side, we can cut the wing tip off. That's your three bone wing then. Take the other tip off. So another three bone wing for a perfect feet of chicken wings, but buffalo wings. And all we do is we skin off the other side and that's just skinless and boneless fillets. Remove any uh, odds and sods and gristle, throw that away. That's, that's how we prep our chickens for your normal standard cuts. If you're barbecuing, really, really popular. This is what people call spatchcock chicken. So with me knife, nice and sharp, cut all the way down through the back of the spine. Same on the other side, whip that out. And we can marinate any chicken for you in store if you wanted to, or just do this for you when you come in. There's your backbone. Open up your chicken, that's a spatchcock chicken. Some people put your skewers in, uh, you can slice them up, score them up, just get all your marinade in, into the bird. Perfect for a barbecue. Put them skin side down, crisp it up. If you put your skewers in, he will hold more of a shape. Turn them over, that's just spatchcock chicken. Perfect if you're gonna uh, barbecue and share with loads of people, so spatchcock chicken. And then come winter time, if you're gonna do some joints and your guests don't wanna cook it as a whole chicken. Don't, don't be afraid, come in and ask us, and what we'll do is do what I call a chicken cushion. So I remove the wing tips, I turn the bird over, I come down the back of the bird, and what I do, I find the, uh, the hip bone on that leg, come down there to the other hip bone, nice and tip, nice and tip, nice and tight, going through the joints. Just, my knife does the work on it, I'm not, I'm not being too forceful. I run down each side of the carcass, so all the meat just falls off the bone. And we turn right under that cavity there, take that right off. So you freeze up all your breast meat. There's your cavity there. You've got one sort of net of a chicken. You can cook it like on the barbecue if you wanted to. But what we're gonna do, we're gonna bone out the legs, taking it off the drumstick, take your knife under it like that, come down, wasting no meat on the leg. Take it through the kneecap, because there's a bit of a kneecap in there. That's one bone out, so you've got a boneless leg. Turn it on the side, bone out, or bone out the chicken wing. What we'll do, we'll come underneath like so. That's one bone, so that's one side of the chicken done. And then come down another side. Take the, the other bone out the other, the other chicken wing. And same again, because I'm right-handed, I always do the other leg slightly different here and because because I am right-handed and what I do I can cut through the joint of the drumstick up like so and then out so I always do the off the other side slightly differently only because I'm right-handed I find it easier and I'll remove that little thigh bone same again with that bit of kneecap and what we would normally do is tear the meat off that thigh and what we do we can do a different stuffing for you ball of sausage meat in the middle that would normally sit on top fold them back up, tie them back up, and then that would become, as you can imagine, when we tied it, that would look into your chicken cushions. So three different ways on how to have a chicken. So that's how we butcher our chicken. 
smash got prepared for a barbecue. We'll have it. Just ask, just, just ask us if we haven't got one prepared, we will do it for you. And that's the chicken cushion. We'll tell me you've tied that up. You can put any different stuff that you want inside. And just our fantastic sausage meat inside is, is absolutely fantastic. Chicken three way. Well, that was really interesting uh, to watch. Some of that I can do myself. Uh, other parts not so well so hopefully you found that interesting um and entertaining um those guys really do know what they're doing down there so uh please like and subscribe to the channel if you want to see anything else then certainly let me know get in touch there's loads more um sort of educational pieces of what to do with certain cuts and things coming and i'll uh, see you soon